storms of life. I want you to know there's peace in the midst of the storm. There is. Yeah, there is. There is. I'm convinced that there is. There is. Elder Eugene Blackman was born November 29, 1969, in Searcy, Arkansas. The firstborn of proud parents Denoris and Albert Blackman. He was saved at the tender age of nine. He has dedicated his life to building the kingdom of God. This extremely gifted, multi-talented musician, father of six, is the husband of one wife, Cynthia Moore Blackman. church and during that time just very loyal and very, very passionate about what he did and always had a k very kindred spirit and there was never anything concerning me and Eugene. I mean we're still probably a mystery to a lot of people right now but as time went on the Lord saw fit to bring us together and just bringing us together in just pure friendship and just getting to know him and knowing him now and how gentle and and passionate he is about God's people and just about people in general, you know, and that was, that's what drew me to him was his heart for love for people. And that within itself actually brought us together as husband and wife, which we, neither one of us would have never ever imagined that happening. We sometimes we look at each other and it's like, ooh, you know, but <laughs> how did that happen? But it was a God choice, you know, and I think that's what makes it so beautiful because it's something we would have never ever chosen. They have love in the storm. I 
know their Bible. He has not given us the spirit of fear, but what? Power. Why? Why? Because it has come, the power has to come through having a sound mind. What so we just said that whatsoever a man thinking or one man thinking, so is them. So what your, your victory is determined by how sound your mind is. Oh, come on, somebody. of the success that God has for him and I've always told him that I just see so much for you and now things and pieces are just coming together just coming together for him and I'm just so excited for what you're going to encounter honey I'm so excited about the, the choice the things that God has planned already and the maps that he's already provided and walked through he's already given you a road map and just continue to walk through it and I'm just tickled pink. I told him I'm your I'm your first fan. I'll be the first one to listen to your music. I'll be the first one to chuckle and laugh because I see the glory of God on his life. And that blesses me more than anything in this world, just seeing the glory of God through his life. If you know you got peace, let me see you say. Yeah, yeah.